Hi, I'm Curtis Parody. It's November 12, 2014, and here's a look at what's happening now. Big news out of YouTube today as an official launch date for YouTube's streaming service has been announced. Yes, the service called YouTube Music Key will be launching in a beta form on Monday. The brand new service will be invite only and will be available on the web, on Android, and iOS. The music streaming app, just like any other music streaming app, will allow you to, of course, stream music, but also, of course, stream music videos, all without advertisements. Now, of course, this is a big thing because already, if you go to YouTube, or of course, you're already on YouTube, you can already watch and listen to music with ads. But of course, the new service adds a couple of different features here. The first, of course, being the lack of ads. The second being brand new custom mixes and playlists. The service also happens to merge with Google Play Music All Access, if you already happen to be paying for that. And the entire thing allows you to save music and music videos for offline viewing and listening right within the app. So if you happen to be disconnected or disconnect often, this could be a thing to be interested in. Once again, launching next Monday in a beta form, it will cost $10 a month. The brand new service will be available in the US, UK, Finland, Italy, Portugal and Spain. So if you happen to be in one of those countries, look out, you can now sign up for this brand new service. Into space type news here, it's official. The European Space Agency have landed a probe onto a comet. For the first time ever, a probe called Rosetta has landed onto a comet that was over 6.4 billion kilometers away. Now the hope with all this is now that they've landed, they can collect a bunch of different data on the comet because surprisingly, we don't actually know a lot about comets out there in space, even though they go whizzing by all the time. So Rosetta will be helpful in collecting a bunch of different data and sending it back to scientists here here on Earth. Beyond that, of course, it's also freaking cool to say we've launched and landed a satellite on a passing comet. And last but certainly not least, this sport right here called Red Bull Crashed Ice is coming to Edmonton, Canada. Yes, if you happen to be living in Edmonton, Alberta, look out because Crashed Ice is coming your way. Now, if you've never heard what Crashed Ice is, it's an extreme sport in a combination of like hockey and like downhill skiing. Different players are suited up in hockey attire and they travel down a track with different drops and turns turns and different gaps that they have to jump over. They also travel up to 60 kilometers an hour on this ice track. Now in the previous years, they've all been based inside of Quebec City, but the founders and the creators of Crash Ice have stated that they need to move into the western part of Canada. So Edmonton seemed like a pretty cool spot to move into and they will be moving there in March of 2015. So again, if you live in Edmonton or around Edmonton or just want to travel there from a different country, you can take part in this awesome, crazy new sport. But jumping back to the big topic of today, are you interested interested in paying $10 a month for a music streaming service from YouTube. I'd love to hear your opinions in the comment section down below. You can also, of course, let me know on my Facebook page or my Twitter account. Links to those are on screen right now and available in the description down below, along with all the topics I've talked about today. And of course, while you're clicking around down there, why not hit that like button, subscribe, and of course, share the show with your friends on social media. Until next Wednesday, everyone, I'm Curtis Parody, and that's what's happening now. Can you imagine me playing like the crashed ice game? Be a whole lot of ah! and then like falling down and probably like breaking arms. It would be a mess. <laughs>